Hello everybody, I am Nook and welcome back to Nook and Cranny Gaming. This is The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And we are at Hyrule Castle. What's up, Navi? The great Deku Tree wanted us to go visit the princess at Hyrule Castle. Shouldn't we get going? We're here already! Oh my gosh. Come on, come on, let's go. Hyrule Castle. Ha! What's this nightmare? Oh, look this way. The princess is inside the castle just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. <laughs> On this ground, time flows normally, but time stands still while you were in Lon Lon Ranch or in town. If you want time to pass normally, you'll need to leave town. Okay, so anyway. Uh, do I want to hear what I said again? No. So you gotta be, he, he said last time, did you get all that? So you'd say yes. And then this time, he asked if you want to hear it all again, and you say no. Because you know. Because you know what's going on. Alright, so we are in Hyrule Castle Land, and it's nighttime. Now we could, we could just walk up to the gate. Let's just do it. Let's do it. Hey, I need through. Can you let me through? Hey, hey. Welcome to Hyrule Castle Town. It's a peaceful, prosperous town. Okay, can I get through here? Nope. Alright then. Well, uh, we're going to have to be sneaky. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe this tree. Hello, tree. Oh! A spider! A spider! I, hit, I hurt myself. It's okay. We won! We got a gold skeleton to load. Get out of here. Give me a heart. Or absolutely nothing. Hello? Chicken? Okay. Climb up here. Ah! It's bright. It's super bright. Okay. Well, we can't get across there. That guard's gonna catch us. Let's pop down here. Sneak out this doorway. Ah, and we're home free! Playing the feud! Let's run. Okay. Come around the corner. Oh no! Okay. But there's one right there, too. Gotta sneak up right between them. Yeah! And then we just take the path like a normal person. And then I see some... Some bricks on the wall there. Maybe we'll be able to climb up those. Swoop around this guard to our right. hey -ya! Get up this brick wall. Alright. So yeah, this, I, I, I... I've played this so many times. Um, and sometimes I don't even finish the game when I play. I just like playing the opening part. Like, going out on an adventure and getting the call for, you know, the to save the world and stuff like that. It's exciting. It's very cool. I don't know, it, it hits home for me. I mean, I think that's why I'm into, like, into Star Wars, too. And there's Kultula in here. Actually, I think you have to play the, the a song that we get later on. Oh, z z z z z A mumble mumble. Welcome, our ranch is so fun. Oh, come on and look around. Okay. z z z z z are these crates of milk? Oh my lord, is this that little girl we met in the market? I found her dad. He's asleep. He's under a spell. The princess of destiny put her under a spell. No, we're, we're good. It's okay. He's okay. We're all fine. We're all fine here. How about you? But no, I think it's a reason that I connect with Star Wars a lot is getting that call to action. You know, and wanting to step out and save the world. Hey, guys. Hey, you stop. You kids over there. I don't know why they sound like a... An interview where you can't know the identity of a person. Okay, so we found Malin's dad. Oh, there she is. Hey, hey, hey. Are you going to the castle, fairy boy? Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. What a thing for an adult to do. Tee-hee. <laughs> oh, yeah. If you'll look for him, I'll give this to you. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. Tee-hee. <laughs> hmm. A weird egg. Feels like there's something moving inside. Set it to see to see what happens, see? On the select get come on. It's very wordy, but you know, something like this really hadn't been done, so I, I give it I give it slack. I give it slack. Because of its age. Okay, so we got the egg. We got the egg. We're gonna go back and find find your dad. Try to wake him up. I don't know what we're gonna do. Got some weird egg. 
Gotta find some girl's dad. You know what? I'm gonna skip the ladder this time. I don't need no ladder. I'm an independent little boy. Don't need no man. Don't need no ladder man. Ladder man. In Mega Man 21. I, I was just... Yeah, it's, these are the jokes. Oh, that makes me want to play Twilight Princess. Man, I, I hope eventually on the channel, I really want to play all of the Zeldas. Uh, especially the ones that I haven't beaten before. Like Seasons and Ages and Adventure of Link. I think it would be a lot of fun to play those and uh, actually get through them. And unfortunately, we have to wait until sunrise because we need this little eggy egg to hatch, so I'll see you in a second. Time war! <laughs> Look! A chicken hatched from the egg we were incubating. Hmm. Chickens are loud. Especially at sunrise. Maybe if we... Reincarnation! I can't a person get a little shut eye around here. Yeah, I'm playing as a Morrow, whatever. Morrow? Morrow, bro. Hello! Who might you be? Yep, I'm Talon, the owner of Lon Lon Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some milk, but I sat down here to rest, and I guess I fell asleep. What? Malin was looking for me. I'm gonna catch it from her now. I messed up bad, leaving Malin behind to wait for me. She's really gonna let me have it. <laughs> Cartoony. That's ruin. Alright. Hmm. So why was that important? Oh, a little hole in the wall, huh? Well, maybe we can jump over there? That's a pretty big jump. I don't know. Maybe we can f use these crates to our advantage. Great idea, Nook! Oh. <laughs> I needed my little disappointed, like, snips in the corner to pop up. Like, really? <laughs> okay, so we got one crate. And I think we're gonna need another box for this crate plan to be pulled off. <laughs> and coming up is... It used to be one of my favorite parts in the game uh, because it was so unique. Like, you've been going through this game, it's just hack slash adventure, hashtag adventure. <laughs> and um, I always push this an extra. Oh, no, I don't. I always try to push it. I always think, like, I'll make, like, a little bridge, but it never works. I apparently have all. I have that thought every time I play this because I was just like, yeah, I always push this right here, but I don't. So we're in the castle courtyard. It's a completely different camera view all of a sudden. And... Oh, there's guards. I gotta sneak. I gotta sneak. <laughs> Shh, be quiet. Okay. Go this way. No. Oh, I should've gone that way. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look at the enticing rupees that they put down there. Oh man. I always tried to go for the rupees. Of course, I always tried to do this too. Which is really hard to see on a CRT, but here, it's real easy to see where that rafter is. That's really surprising. Man, this is almost like playing a completely different game with the look being ha ah, ah, ha so sharp. Oh no. Ha ah, ha. Something I've always wondered is what that, that statue's supposed to be. There's all these random statues in the garden. I'd really like to know the lore behind them. Even, you know, it's something small, but uh, it's stuff that I'm into. I love learning the lore of, like, art and architecture and, and different uh, fantasy worlds. It's just really interesting stuff. Like this guy. It looks like a Greek phil philosopher. A philosopher. Um, but, you know, Greece doesn't exist in Hy Hyrule. 
toga man here. Or, like, a man that was caught naked with a robe on. He's like... <laughs> <laughs> like his daughter walked in on him after he, after he showered or something. That's probably bad. I mean, just... It's, it happens, right? Okay, so before we talk to her, we're going to take a look around. How about that? So... What's over in this window? Uh, let's see if there's anybody in there. No? Okay. Okay. Well. Hmm. <gasps> Those are some colorful paintings. <gasps> 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 Mario! It's Mario and Peach! That Peach painting always reminded me of Super Mario RPG. Like, that's obviously supposed to be Super Mario 64. Because he's got the little wings off his hat. You can see those. But the Peach drawing right there always reminds me of uh, a Super Mario RPG. And then this way you got Yoshi Yosh. He's on the wall there. And then... Uh, <gasps> Bowser. And then the other fun thing, if I remember correctly... Oh, yay. A rupee. That's not the fun thing that I remember. Maybe it's at the other window. No? Okay, let's try this one, though. <gasps> okay, we're good. <laughs> little guard pops out. Hey, you. Don't cause any trouble. Hey, what's that little kid doing out there with the princess? I don't know. <gasps> Who? Who are you? How did you get past the guards? Oh, what's that? Is that... A fairy? Then are you from the forest? Then then you would... You wouldn't happen to have the spiritual stone of the forest, would you? That green and shining stone? ba da da, -da. Yeah, we do. <laughs> Just as I thought. I had a dream. In the dream, dark storm clouds were billowing over the land of Hyrule. But suddenly a ray of light shot out of the forest, parted the clouds, and lit up the stone. Was it me, baby? The light turned into a figure holding a green and shining stone, followed by a fairy. I know this is a prophecy that someone would come from the forest. Yes, I thought you might be the one. Oh, I'm sorry. I got carried away by my story and didn't even properly introduce myself. I am Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. What is your name? But I can't, we can't talk. Nook. Strange, it sounds somehow familiar. How did she know? Navi didn't say anything. What happened? Okay then, Nook. I'm going to tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. Please keep this as a secret from everyone. Okay. Or, no. Okay. The legend goes like this. Uh, we already heard this story. Oh, wait. The three goddesses hid the Triforce containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. Hyrule. I ran out of breath. The power to grant the wish of one who holds the Triforce in his hands. If someone with a righteous heart makes a wish, it will lead Hyrule to a golden age of prosperity. If someone with an evil mind has his wish granted, the world will be consumed by evil. That is what has been told. So, the ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the Triforce from evil ones. The Temple of Time. Mm -hmm. This is some heavy stuff. I'm like nine, maybe eleven. That's right, the Temple of Time is the entrance through which you can enter the sacred realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed with a stone wall called the Door of Time. 
And in order to open the door, it is said that you need to collect three spiritual stones. And another thing you need is the treasure that the royal family keeps along with this legend. The Ocarina of Time. That's the title of the game! Seems important. Do you understand well the story I just told you? I got it. That's great! I forgot to tell you. I was spying through this window just now. The other element from my dream. The dark clouds. I believe they symbolize that man in there. It's like her dad on the throne. <laughs> Another chicken, please! Will you look through the window at him? Yeah? Let's take a look. Who is this douche? <gasps> it's Green Man from our dreams! Can you see the man with the evil eyes? <laughs> that is Ganondorf, the leader of the Gerudos. They hail from the desert far to the west. Though he swears allegiance to my father, I'm sure he is not sincere. The dark clouds that covered Hyrule in my dream, they must symbolize that man. <gasps> what happened? Did he see you? Don't worry. He doesn't have any idea what we're planning yet. Yes. <laughs> I told my father about the dream. However, he didn't believe it was a prophecy. But I can sense that man's evil intentions. What Ganondorf is after must be nothing less than the Triforce of the Sacred Realm. He must have come to Hyrule to obtain it. And he wants to conquer Hyrule. No. The entire world. Nook! Now, we are the only ones who can protect Hyrule. Please! Will we protect Hyrule? I don't know. Let's find out in the next episode of Nook and Cranny Gaming. Thank you so much for watching. I am Nook, and this is The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Let me know what you think about the whole story and the lore and uh, your thoughts on Ganondorf and why he exists, because the people who know the Gerudo people know that they're all ladies. Let me know what you think in the comments below and uh, what you're looking forward most to in the game. So thank you so much for watching. See you in the next episode.